Hey guys, it's been a while since I've recorded my last video. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to make an outbound Google Voice or formerly Grand Central phone call using the iPhone. Now what I have here is you're looking at what I see on my iPhone which is basically the exact same thing so <clears throat> I'm gonna walk you through it so you can not only get a feel of how to do it so so the first thing you're gonna to want to do is you're gonna to want to put in your Grand Central phone number so I'm just gonna spoof it 403-555-1234 okay so now you've got your Grand Central number in now what you do is you hit the uh, plus star pound key and you notice you've got pause. So you hit pause, hit two, hit pause again, and then you dial the number you want to call. So for instance, I want to call 503-555-5522. So that's assuming that's the phone number you want. Now what you're going to want to do is save this as a contact. Now the only problem is there is somewhat of a lag between when you hit call and when the call gets gets placed because basically what you're doing is you're setting up a script that calls your your Google Voice phone number places the call pauses for a second inputs the number 2 which lets you place an outbound call and then types in the phone number that you're trying to dial so to give you an idea of what that's like I'm going to take my phone and I've already pre-programmed my home phone in here so I'm basically I'm doing this off camera so let me go in here Google Voice test I'm gonna put it on speakerphone no new messages to place a call press 2 for Google 411 please enter the phone number you would like to dial followed by the pound key So it's already placed the call, and there it goes. It's ringing. Hello? Hello? Hi. So it takes about 20 seconds from the time you place the call to the point where it gets put through. Now this is, that's a long time to wait. However, using this as a loophole, say if you're on T-Mobile, if you're on T-Mobile, you can have my faves, which allow you 5, 10, 15 numbers to call unlimited. You can use this method to dial your, your Google Voice number to connect to someone else. It's like a forwarding number. So this would allow you to get unlimited inbound and outbound calls, assuming you hand out your Google Voice number to people to call, which would then get routed back into you now the nice thing about that is when they call you they're gonna show up as your Google Voice number now to T-Mobile all they're gonna see is a ton of Google Voice they're only gonna see your Google Voice number so if if T-Mobile had 3G that wasn't a crazy a crazy you know different style that didn't work with the iPhone or that did work with the iPhone then yeah I'd, I'd switch to T-Mobile in a heartbeat because cheaper calls free calls unlimited but for right now, the way AT&T is set up, I'm happy. But So this has basically been my little experiment to show you how to place an outbound call with your Google Voice number. I've already showed you how to place an outbound call of Google Voice on the iPhone, which you can see on IamTheKiller.net. It's not a recent article. It involves you running... Uh, you can now run, let's see, no, it, it involves you running Fring, which is a free application, but you still have to dial out of your Grand Central number. Now that was using an application called Grand Dialer, which unfortunately has been discontinued because it does not work with Google Voice. So I would probably have to update that guide to get it to work with Google Voice, but it can be done. And it requires a small hack to get VoIP to run over 3G because right now it's not made to run over 3G but we'll see what happens in firmware 3.0 so that's my video for today I hope you enjoyed it and thanks for watching